Not a, this is not a scam, it's a legend call. Attached. Well, I don't know. I didn't do it. All right. So no worries, as you are telling me, sir, that you didn't authorize this credit line and this transaction. This time, I will be putting a hold on this PayPal line of credit first. That's okay. why we are on this recorded line. Yeah, that while we good. are on this recorded line. All right. Yeah. No more purchases has been done. More. Okay. All right? Good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Just stay on the line. Let me put a hold, and I will be right back to you. Okay. Okay. Holding the line, Hall. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. All right. So, Hall, as I can see here. I can see here this time I have put it a hole on this PayPal line okay, of credit good. this time. Yeah. And all as I can see here with this credit line account there are some other transactions as well. So first of all let me give you the transaction history detail of this credit line account. And if you recognize any one of these transactions then let me know. Okay. Alright, so all as I can see here there was in second transaction for four hundred eighty nine dollars and ninety nine cents for a Nike Air Four shoes. Nope. Which is coming from a location. Nope. Okay, and this purchase is coming from Ohio location hall. Do you know anybody from Ohio? No. All right. And hall, I can see here there was a third transaction for seven hundred ninety-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents for an Apple iPhone purchase, which is coming from a location that is Texas. So, do you know anybody from Texas? Yeah, I know somebody in Texas, Happy on Cassidy. Mm -hmm. But he doesn't okay, have my PayPal information. Happy wouldn't do that. He doesn't have my information. I don't even know my information. I haven't used it in so long. Okay. And do you suspect anybody from Texas who can do this thing apart from you? Um, Roy Rogers, maybe. He's all Because sneaky. I can see here, sir, with this credit line account, all the information like your driver license, your social security number and your banking information is verified with this credit line account. And that's why this credit line is given to you for $5,200. But I didn't apply for it. I get that. But that means there is somebody outside who has access to your credentials. That's why they have applied my for a credit well, line with paper. How do I stop them from getting my credentials? No worries. First of all, what we're going to do here, we will be filling a dispute form for you for all okay, of these yeah. transactions on your behalf. Do that. Yeah. Okay. Because, yeah, and all as I can see here, there was a fourth transaction on this credit line account, which is for $1,299. Yeah. No. There was a last transaction for $1,299.99. No way. For a Bitcoin purchase. Bitcoin? That's all yeah. phony shit. I would never buy that. Okay, and do you know anybody from Mexico? Because I can see here this purchase is coming from Mexico. Mexico, the country? Yeah. No, I don't know anybody in Mexico. Well, Manuel, but he wouldn't do it either. And may I know that by any chance did you ever lost your credentials anywhere, Law Hall? I never lost like my credentials. No, I never lost my credentials. Like your wallet? No. How would I lose my wallet? Well, what am I, 12? No, I didn't lose my wallet. 72 right. years of age. I wouldn't lose a wallet. Uh, I totally get that, mister. But no worries. I will be definitely helping you to cancel all of these transactions. Okay. First of all, yeah. First of all, let me fill a dispute form for you, sir. Okay, go and ahead. And let me have some... Yeah, and let me have some words with my security department about okay. this case. Yeah. Because what I suspect here right now might be there is somebody outside who has access to your credential, and this is a clear-cut case of an identity theft. Oh, yeah, it sounds like it, doesn't it? Yeah, just stay on the line, Hall. I will be right back to okay. you in get one to two minutes of your time. Uh, okay, please hurry. Fault attendant. Recorded. Thanks for calling PayPal. My name is Ron. How can I help you? I got a thing saying somebody bought a some kind of notebook for eight hundred eighty-eight dollars uh, okay. through PayPal, uh, but I didn't do it. Okay. Uh, okay. And when did you receive that notification? May I know? Uh, probably, when did you got that? I don't know. Half hour. I don't know. I I didn't pay any attention. Thank you for holding the line. Okay. Right and uh, may I know, sir? Is it like? Uh, as you were telling me that you did not authorize the transaction. Hello, by any chance, Hall, did you share here? your password with anybody? Like no, I didn't, any I didn't share my password with anybody. Mm -hmm. Okay, no worries about that, sir. First of all, I sincerely Hello, apologize you, for Mr. the Hall? inconvenience caused to you. Yeah. No worries, I'm on this site, and I definitely are can you help you out. No to worries. Me? 
No, I, I called back another mm -hmm. guy because I didn't know where you went. Mm -hmm. Pardon me? I got that, no worries. So first of all, can you please help me with your email address? So I did you get receive that. this notification? Can you repeat that for me? Yeah, it's uh, piper23 at gmail.com. I already told the other guy all this. I don't know where he went. I really apologize for that, sir. So for the previous to guy, me? may I know uh, the name oh, of the Oh, wait a minute. The other guy is back. Can we talk to Wait, the other guy is back. Are you back? Yeah, I'm here. Are uh, you talking to me? No, I'm talking to another guy because I thought you hung up. Okay, I'm all I'm all set with you, and then I'll talk to the the, the old guy. Okay. So which guy, me I know? You. And who? Huh? Did you talk with anybody about this case? Yeah, I just called. Me I know who called you? Nobody called me. I called them. To whom? PayPal. But this time you're connected with PayPal. But you, I thought you hung up, so I called again, and another guy answered from PayPal. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Now what? Can you disconnect that? I did. That's great. All right. Okay. Will you be so my valentine? That time? Pardon me? Will you be my valentine? No, I'm not of that type person. Oh, you don't want to be my valentine? Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, I just thought I'd ask you, you scamming bastard. Oh. You piece of shit. Ah, you are. Any other thing? No, can you, you do other thing? You're just can a you thief. Do, can you listen to me? Please, please, please. Yeah, listen, okay, go ahead. Drop your pants and flap on your ass, motherfucker. Oh, boy, you guys. <laughs> you fault attendant. Recorded. Calling PayPal, my name is Ron, how can I help you? Yeah, you know what the other guy told me? Yeah? He told me to drop my pants and slap my ass. Can he talk to me like that? No, sir. If you were connected on PayPal... Yeah, I, I, all I did was I, I asked him to be my valentine. Able to tell you that. I asked him to be my valentine and he took offense for some reason. I got that, sir, and I really apologize yeah. for that. Will you be my valentine? I <laughs> Huh? Then you have to do one thing. You have to come here and suck my dick. Oh, okay, scammer. Hall, Hall, learn, 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 learn to talk with that. Default attendant. Thank you for calling in. My name is Brandon. How may I help you? Hello. Yes, sir. How can I help you? Yes. I, I, the phone's still ringing and I'm talking to you. I don't get it. Hello? Hello? Yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. How can I help you, sir? Will you be my valentine? I'm stupid. <laughs> This call may be recorded for internal quality purpose. Thank you for calling support. You're talking to Wiley. How may I assist you? I got a thing saying that my thing, my Norton's being renewed, but I never renewed it. Renewed? Okay, I'll go ahead and check for the same, sir. Can you help me out with your registered phone number? Let me pull up the account first. Yeah, it's uh, 31498. Let me okay. check, sir. Is this the only number you're using right now? No. Okay, the number I got from you, I'll repeat. It's, is that yeah. right? Is there any other number you have, sir, apart from this you registered well, with I got us? my cell phone. Could be. May I know that? Yeah, it's... Uh, so, one, right. right? Okay, I'll let me check with this number. Have you taken any service recently from our company, no, sir? No, absolutely not. That's why I don't know why I'm getting billed. Three ninety nine point ninety nine for something I there didn't must order. Be a reason, well, sir. I'm sure there's a reason, but I okay. didn't order it, so I want to cancel it. Okay, once I open the account, I'll let you know about this. Uh, but uh, the numbers you have provided to me, it's not showing any record. May I know your full name, Peter? Uh, and you need to go slow so that I can write down properly. It's Peter. P e t e r, Piper. Okay. P i p e r. P i p e r. Peter okay. Piper. So there is no middle initial in between, no. right? This is the complete nope. name. Peter Piper. Peter Piper. Okay. And how did he get this information that you have been billed this amount? It was a text uh, is thing. it on your email? It was. It was. I think it was email. I don't remember. I don't know. I just wrote the number down to call so I can get it canceled. Can't you just cancel it? 
officer, but when I'm not able to pull up the account, how, how would I actually know that what is the service you have taken? Uh, well, okay. Because the number you're sharing with me... Just cancel it. It's, it did not, that's all you got to do. I need to have more information, sir. When you say that you see the charge, did you see this charge on your statement? No. Or could you help me out with... No, no. no? I got okay. an email. Email, okay. Um, may I know your um, email address, sir, if you don't mind sharing? Let me check with that. T-I-P-E-R-2-3 at gmail.com. T-I-P-E-R-2-3, right? Right. Okay, at gmail.com. Let me check okay. for this, uh, with this last time. I apologize for the inconvenience. Okay. Hello, anybody there? I am connected, sir. Right now, I'm checking for the information. Oh, I request you to please well, bear with me. Well, can we hurry me? up with this? Uh, I just want to cancel uh, something. I, I, it's not brain surgery. That's what I'm doing, sir. That's what I'm checking for. So please stay connected. Okay, please hurry. Uh, sir, the email uh, you have shared with me that you received uh, some email informing you about this charge of $399, right? right? Okay, and uh, do you have that email in front of you right now? No. You don't. Okay. Uh, so you need to have that email, sir. And like, you need to give us the information uh, about that email. That, uh, from where did you receive that? Uh, you need to give us the email address you received it from. If it's giving you the not a ren renewal um, thing, we do not do that. Like, we do not, uh, you know, go with any um, direct renewal with the customer. Well, I... I, okay. I, I, why did they tell me to call this number then in the email? I don't understand. Sir, uh, you need to check uh, your bank statement and make sure that the payment is being charged or not, okay? Because we do not have any renewal policy uh, with our company. Then why so did I get a, no why, then why did I get a thing from the cancellation department? I don't know. Do you know? Cancel it. I'll still go ahead and check for the same, but... Um, for this, it would take time, and um, I would call you back on this number. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I, found, the I found the I email. I found it. You have the yeah. email? Okay. It says, Dear customer, please call a worthless scammer from the shithole country of India and hear her mm -hmm. beg like a hungry little dog in the street. Mm-hmm. And then it's got a number after it, 6791247. <laughs>